The one thing I like about the P-Mentor is that it is, uh, it was designed as a trainer. It was brought into the world with the, the, the thoughts of a student in mind. The cockpit layout that we currently have is absolutely perfect for us in the way that we train our crew flight. Uh, we can put two pilots in there and they have very individualized uh, crew stations that they can work the nav system together with uh, and it helps us specifically on the, the commercial pilot crewing aspect of it. But for the private pilot I think it brings technology to their, to their cockpit. I think that it brings stability to their airframe but it also requires them to fly the aircraft. When, when we were in our transition phase and we had new Pipers, new legacy aircraft, those pilots didn't like to fly the Technums because the Technums were more work, for, not work, but they were more of an effort. So they, had to, they felt like they had to relearn how to fly because they were missing a lot of the skills that the Piper just didn't bring to their stick and rudder. Whereas our Sierra students and our mentor students, they looked at the Piper as, as a bit of a caveman airplane and it was so easy to, for them to fly that they just didn't enjoy it. Our instructors uh, come in, you know, they're used to uh, an older uh, airframe, Cessna or Piper. Uh, they come into the Technums, we usually give them about five hours of instruction for their crossover syllabus and then we standardize them in, uh, in our Technum aircraft, both in the Sierra and, and in the P-Mentor. Uh, separately, so they'll get five hours in each aircraft. So, but really, it's it's more about the glass, like like you hinted at. We're introducing them to those modern systems, which they love. We've transitioned out of our other aircraft into a complete Technum fleet to standardize uh, not only from our maintenance side of the operations to ensure that we have continuity through maintenance, but also through our flight training with our students. And we have orders for a lot more P-Mentors in the future and we're, as we grow and expand our fleet, not only here at our home base, but as we grow with the university and other markets around the state of Texas, we'll need to, to spool up that fleet quite rapidly.